baseball team. We cheer the Pittsburgh Steelers. Hey guys, welcome to Pittsburgh. This is Anthony and Hunter. And we're just chilling down here in the cash cave. Um, I did get a box of cards from a friend of mine and I wanted to do a unboxing for you. And I uh, figured I'd throw it in the daily vlog. Um, the reason Hunter's down here is uh, he hasn't been feeling too good lately. Um, he's been having some issues with his bladder stones. He has been peeing a lot of blood. And uh, the other night he had a really severe seizure. Um, where he lost control of his bladder and it was like so bad that we thought we were going to lose him. So uh, this morning I'm actually taking a hiatus from the morning show and we're taking this awesome little cute puppy dog to the vet to get checked out. But um, since it's still early and there's construction on the house and I'm awake, I figured uh, this would be a great opportunity for me to uh, film going through this box because this is going to be pretty epic um just got all of my orders packed for the day it's a pretty light day i only got five things going out right now um but um i got some fba going out so that doesn't really count though because i don't have to pack it but it does make me money so i'm happy in that regard so i um, gonna get open in these cards show you guys what we find guys yeah, so here we go I'm gonna just stabilize the card cam and me and Hunter are gonna tear into this box so this is from my friend Dave um, thank you Dave so much I really appreciate it if you're watching this appreciate it even if you're not watching it but um, he hooked me up with a whole bunch of cards from his personal collection so I'm looking forward to seeing what those are and uh, supposedly they're all teams that I like so let's start it off we got got a LeBron James in the Cavs uni that's a pretty nice card that's awesome that's definitely going in the personal collection another LeBron heck yeah beautiful that's awesome so what years those are uh, looks like that's a 2007 it's another LeBron is that a 2004 so this is his second year right here that's awesome. Or is this technically considered a rookie? Doesn't have any stats or anything like that. He was his rookie year was the 0304 year. So that may be a rookie card right there, guys. That is amazing. Thank you so much for that, Dave. You know what? Let me just stick that in the front for now. Who we got here? Got an all-star here of Jamal Mashburn. That's a jersey card. That's awesome. That's really cool. Got another jersey card here of... Uh, let me just make sure I have you guys on screen. Sorry if I didn't, guys. Uh, we got Keith Van Horn for the uh, Knicks and Aaron McKee for the uh, Sixers. It's kind of cool. got some pirates now put the cabs down over here got bob johnson oh wow look at that that's numbered out of 25 is that jarvis jones yeah and it's blue wow dave you're you outdid yourself man this is amazing wow i was definitely not expecting anything like this holy heck look at that air marshals die cut ben roethlisberger that is awesome it's from prism yeah, this is this is definitely a whole Topps Chrome Pro Bowl edition Ben Roethlisberger. That is awesome. Yeah, this is like an entire box of stuff going into my personal collection. So I really, really appreciate it, Dave. Because I do collect uh, all of these teams here. Steelers, Pirates, Penguins, and Cavaliers. Got some Francos. That's awesome, man. Francos is like one of my... Mean Joe. Good Lord. This is epic. Got another Joe Green here. Good God. This is amazing, man. Thank you so much. I'm like blown away with these cards. Like seriously blown away with these. Huh, Bubba? You blown away, buddy? Good boy. So got the Mean Joe. Got a Le'Veon right here. When's that from? 17. I'm trying to remember the year he was drafted. It's definitely not a rookie, I don't think. Got a Franco. 
the Dermani Dawson, that dude was the truth. Mike Webster, man. RIP. He was the uh, first guy with uh, CTE. But he was a heck of a center. Absolutely baller. Look at Greg Lloyd. He probably just knocked this dude over and he's helping him up. That dude was a beast. I used to rock that same face mask whenever I played football. Shazier. Man, I'd love to see this guy come back. Palomalu. Wow. These cards are epic, Dave. Thank you so much, man. A little Jesse James action. Heinz Ward. Wow. Yeah, these cards are amazing, man. LC Greenwood. Wow. Carnell Lake. That is awesome, man. A little 90s Steeler football. The 90s is when I really fell in love with the Steelers because I was born in 84. So, you know what I mean? By the time I could really understand the game, um, it was the 90s and I was just like loving the Steelers. Lewis Lips. Got a little Merrill Hodge action going. A little more Merrill Hodge. Heath Miller. That's pretty cool. Look, he... He found some cat treats I have up here. A little John Stallworth, Super Bowl Superman. That's so cool. Man. This is like literally the most epic box. Hall of Famer, Franco Harris. Relax, Bobos. You don't get no cat treats, okay? Love the jersey there. This is a really slick looking card. Heath Miller. Heath Miller was the man. Plexico Burris, rookie. That's how you can tell he has the 88. Changed his number to 80. Shh, stop it. He's over here playing with my stuff. Come here, buddies. Come here, babies. But yeah, so it also says 99 opener. Burris was uh, drafted in the 2000 season. So that's kind of cool. Got a Willie Parker. Love these tops grow, man. Those are so slick looking. Touch. Keep these in little stacks of teams. That's awesome, man. I miss McCutcheon. I still have his jersey. We used to have a guy at my church that looked just like McCutcheon. Bubba, you don't need to be climbing up on there, buddy. Ugh. Apparently, we just had a dog take over the video, y'all. Hold on one sec. You go down the floor, buddies. Yeah, there you go. Sorry about that, guys. Man, these uh, McCutcheons are nice. I love these, like, OG, but, like, new-looking cards. Awesome. Yeah, I'm a big Pirates fan. Not that they're, like, ever any good, but grew up in uh, Marte, Marte Parte, rookie card. Garrett Cole. Another little Marte. I, I love the design of these cards. Really do. Prism. Gypsy Queen. I really like the way uh, Gypsy Queen is. I like Polanco a lot, too. El Cafe. That's awesome. Gypsy Queen. I love these Gypsy Queen cards. Josh Bell. Man. Dave hooked it up, guys. <laughs> he hooked it up. These cards are epic. Wow. Kevin Kramer, rookie. Nice. Another Kevin Kramer rookie. Austin Meadows. Brian Giles. Man. This must have been the minor league Indians right here. The Canton Akron Indians. Jason Grilly. Chris Archer.
It's a nice looking cold tucker. A little refractor action going there. I don't know if that'd be called a refractor or a silver, but that's nice. I'm a sucker for shiny things. Neil Walker is from Pittsburgh. Love those cards right there. It's awesome. Little Jay Hay action. Hunter, we got a little Jay Hay action going on, buddy. Yeah, you can come up in a minute, buddies, okay? Lariano. Look at that Jason Kendall rookie card. That is awesome. Jason Kendall's that dude, man. I used to have his card, or not his card, but his jersey back in the day. I used to rock it all the time. Stay. Stay. Yeah, that's definitely epic, though. Like, literally. It, it, oh, Barry Bonds. Nice. I love Barry Bonds. Well, I, I loved him more as a pirate, I should say. But, I mean, I, I like him in general. This dog apparently ain't going to leave my stuff alone. So, sorry, guys, if you missed any of those. That's amazing. Wow. Hold on one sec, guys. You're tipping over all the cards, bro. Down. You don't get to come up now. You ruined it. Sorry about that, y'all. Just trying to trying to steal my cat treats. Because he don't normally come down here. Nala does, but... Um, I've been taking him everywhere with me since his seizure, um, just because I'm worried, you know what I mean? I don't want something to happen and me not be there to help him. So he's literally gone everywhere I've gone with me the past couple days. That's a real nice Barry Bonds or Bowman. I like that silver. Put another Barry Bonds right there. Bobby Bonilla. It's awesome. Was a big fan of Bobby Bonilla too. 24, 25 Bonilla and uh, Bonds. Dang, look at this one, man. Look at this Craig Wilson right here. It's got a piece of his jersey and a piece of his bat. That is so awesome, man. That is so cool. This is the, actually the first bat jersey, or yeah, the bat, first bat card that I've ever owned. So thank you. So, oh, and it's numbered out of 50. That is awesome. Dave, thank you so much for that, man. That is so cool. A little Dave Parker action. Oh, shout out to uh, Greg if he's watching. Greg Cherry, Andy Van Slyke. Relax, Papa's okay. You come up soon as I'm done, okay? Little Van Slyke. I know, bud. You want to come see the cards? No, you want to come eat all the cat treats, huh? Let's see if I can give him one more shot, guys. Oh, he just bumped his head. Stay. Stay. We are looking at cards. We are not eating cat treats. Okay. So we have Bob Walk. Nice. Andy Van Slyke again. No cat treats. Go on the floor. You can't be trusted to not go after the cat treats. Andy Van Slyke. Bill Madlock. Doug Drayback. Another Doug. Doug has a nice little Larry Lafferty mustache. A little more Doug. A little more Bob Walk action. Brian Giles. A little more Bob Walk. More Giles. I like the shine of that. These cards are epic, man. Thank you so much, Dave. It's amazing. Nice, A.J. Burnett. What? Another autograph? Jose Guillen? That is awesome, Dave. Thank you so much, man. Like, I, I definitely did not expect, like, autographs and jerseys and stuff like that to be in here. So thank you so much. That is so, that is so generous of you, man. Pedro Alvarez. Haven't seen him in forever. Let's polish up oh, the rest of this stack here. Still got a little Pedro action going. Jason Bay. Kevin Young. A little Randy Tomlin. Don Slot. 
more Jason Kendall. A little Mercer. Sid Bream. More Kendall. It's another uh, Jason Kendall rookie. I was a huge fan of Kendall back in the day. Jeff Locke. Charlie Morton. AJ Burnett. More Morton. Jordy Mercer. Nice little Andy LaRoche right there. I like the style of that card. That reminds me of like the OG uh, Clemente. This is a piece I have in my collection. I found at the bins. Um, it's not the actual cards. They're just like prints. But uh, being that Clemente is my favorite baseball player of all time, I kept it. Use it as like a little decoration. Figure if you get it at the bins and it's like nothing, might as well. Doug Drayback. Jaso. Walk. Dave Parker. Dave Parker was the man. Oh, tumbling over my uh, pirate cards here. Let me make sure they don't get damaged. I'm like super anal about making sure cards stay in good condition. But this is awesome because my pirates collection wasn't that big. So this is literally like got my collection off to like a really nice start i used to have a lot more pirates back in the day and then i got out of collecting for a while and now that i'm back into it i'm love i love the style of tops chrome look we got another autograph here uh wow nathan mcleod can't tell if that's printed or if that's like an actual signed thing Marte, bellinger Boggs, Yelich, Johnny Bench, he was the truth back in the day, Ricky Henderson, cool. so we got some like Hall of Famers going here now, wow, little Lou Brock, Magic, nice, Bryce Harper, that's what's up, Ichiro, that's nice, Pedro Martinez, Mike Schmidt, Greg Maddox, that dude was legit, man. He played for the Braves. Mark McGuire. I used to have his uh, rookie card back in the day. The real good one. Mike Piazza, he was the man. A little more Ichiro. Ryan Sandberg. Moses Malone. A little Johnny Stockton. Spud Webb. <laughs> yes. <laughs> Barkley. That dude was the truth, man. I've been watching a lot of his highlights lately. He was he was legit the man back in the day. A little more Ichiro. Got a St Sandy Koufax here. And we got a Noah Snyder guard. That's nice. That's real nice. It's like a silver prism. That's really nice. Thank you so much for these, Dave. Seriously, man. Like I, I genuinely do appreciate each and every one of these cards and... Uh, like I said, all, almost all of these are going to go to the personal collection. Like, it, it's just, it's insane, man. Like, the the awesome cards that you were just willing to just give me for free. That's super cool of you, man. I genuinely appreciate it. And um, these will definitely, definitely bolster my collection a lot. So, thank you so much for that. All right, guys. So, we dropped Hunter off. Um, they wouldn't let us stay with him due to COVID. So we're on our way back to get him right now. And uh, I'm gonna have Ashley give you guys an update as to what's going on because I don't uh, have the medical terminologies down as she does. Hi guys. So we dropped him off at a quarter to 11. 10.30. We left him at quarter to 11. It's now 4.30, so we're going to pick him back up. They did a complete workup, um, x-rays, blood work, urinalysis, everything, top to bottom. Um, they found that he does have an enlarged tart, um, and he does have a heart murmur, but he does not. They're, wait, they're also waiting for the CMP to come back, which is basically a heart test to tell us if his heart's working correctly. Um, he has a very a pretty bad UTI 
which more than likely is coming from the two bladder stones that he has, that he's had for the last eight years. Um, they did suggest that we get them surgically removed because they're pretty big and they're sitting right on like the tip of his urethra. So what happens is if the stone then goes into the urethra, it can cause a blockage, which can then cause his body to um, build up toxins because he's not getting it out through um, the urine and he could go septic and die. So they're suggesting that we get those taken care of. Um, and other than that, I mean, they said that he's there from on their standpoint with all the testing they did, they cannot find a reason that his, that he had a seizure. They said his thyroid looks good. They said his liver looks good. The only concern is the stones. So that is that. We're going to put him on an antibiotic, an anti-inflammatory, um, we're going to go back in a week just to make sure, you know, he didn't have any more episodes or anything. Um, if he does have more episodes, then they suggest that we go see a neurologist and get him on an anti-seizure medication. The end. Yeah, so that's what's going on, guys. We're going to pick him up. We're going to take him home. And oh, we're... the biggest news. There was no tumors. Praise God. Yes. There, they were concerned um, that he had a tumor um, or cancer and he does not so praise the lord for that the end times two pto yeah so we'll uh, show you him whenever we get him guys and then we're gonna take him home and pour out all types of love on him guys looks who's home hunter's home <laughs> he's doing a lot better guys they must have given him something to calm him down because he's been super chill since he's been back so Happy to have him back, happy he's doing good, and we'll keep you guys posted with uh, any and all updates in regards to him.